for your box? That one. And we're gonna unseal that one right there. Damn it, chat. Why are you in the way? I don't I don't want you in the way. Come on, chat. Over here, here you go. There you go. You can hang out right there. <laughs> we'll just we'll just hide this kind of ugly part of my room. I'm gonna put my hand down, because I was holding it up a long time and it started hurting. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna we're gonna unseal this here in a minute. So that seems awful quiet. Is Twitch screwing up again, or is that just chat being quiet? Because yesterday, when we fired this up, like, Twitch just broke and chat couldn't talk to me. And then I missed all the messages. It's all good? Okay. Okay. So here we go. This is Shadow War. Right here. Boom! Look at that. Isn't that nice? I'll just leave the chat there on my mouse. This is my box of Shadow Warrior. It's not perfect. It's got flaws. It's used. It's got a sticker on here that I should probably deal with. But it's my box of Shadow Warrior. And I love it. I can probably... Why don't I do this? No, I don't want to mess with that. Never mind. I was going to say I'd add my face cam in, but I really don't feel like... Uh... Just being quiet, I think. Okay, nice. Um, I like how there's a 3D effect sticker here that's on sideways. Free upgrade to support. Details on a website. 3D FX graphics card. 3D, 3D FX interactive graphics cards. Who wants some wang? Oh, it's a piece of scotch tape there. Yeah, I've really got to clean this box up at some point. Like, the box has got nice sharp corners on it. It's just like a few spots that it's... Uh, kind of ugly. Actually, that corner's kind of fucked up. And there's way more tape back here, which I have to, like, you know, deal with heat and stuff to do that. Ah, the first 3D action game from 3D Realms since the overwhelmingly successful Duke Nukem 3D. And it looks to be a major step forward from next generation. Cremates the competition, Game Slice Weekly. Wow. Did, did somebody's dad come up with that one? That's bad. Better than Duke Nukem 3D. Games Domain. That's my people right there. That's my people. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> From the creators of Duke Nukem 3D. I'm gonna have to fix that. I'm probably gonna have to cut cardboard and stick it in here so this thing keeps its shape. Actually, it does have a cardboard insert. We'll dig into that in a minute. Ah, Shadow Warrior. Who wants some Wang? Lo Wang is Shadow Warrior, number one assassin, number one accuse, uh, Yakuza abuser, number one freak fragger, number one mutant mutilator. Good lord. Good lord. I mean, I love it. I do. But but damn, guys. It's crazy. So say sayonara to all, that nin all the ninja wannabes that have gone before and put on combat sandals. Lo Wang is coming. Lo Wang is coming, guys. It's happening right there. To the land of the rising sun. Sun to turn out the lights. What? What? Okay. Lo Wang is coming to the land of the rising sun to turn out the lights. Man, who writes this shit? It's terrible. I should probably put that tune on loop, huh? We're gonna be here for a while. We need music. There we go. Experience total bloody immersion. If you can't touch, kill, or drive something, then blow it away. Whether you're wielding katanas and Uzi, not dual Uzis, and Uzi, or a freshly plundered guardian head. Yes, that's right. You can use heads as weapons. You've got your work cut out for you. Enter the world's most interactive 3D environment and cut yourself some sushi. New and improved build editor for designing and destroying your own environments. It's true, this shipped with a build editor that I kind of want to check out at some point. Not today. Not today. That's for a different day. 28 huge levels, 6 specifically designed for multiplayer wangbangs. That's an actual term on the back of the box. 
swim, duck, jump, drive, vehicles climb, ladders go everywhere, do anything. Hmm. It's probably... Nobody's been, been able to get away with go anywhere and do anything uh, since uh, No Man's Sky. <laughs> Advanced graphic effects like fog, multicolored lighting, and transparent water creates total immersion, supports up to 800 and six by 600 resolution, which in my opinion is the perfect resolution. It's my favorite resolution. I used to think it was 1024 by 768, but I really like 800 by 600, especially on a CRT. Opera has found the new emotes. Welcome in, Opera. We are, um, I'm showing you my wangs. <laughs> ah, built from the ground up to the, uh, blah, 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 blah. built from the ground up, the ultimate wang bang, choose deathmatch co-op, team play, or capture the flag with up to eight players, two by modem. I did not know that the original Shadow Warrior actually came with co-op. I have never once played its multiplayer. I would kill for that. I would kill you all in that. I would love it. This is something that that some of us old school junkies should um, actually talk about because I've only done it on local network, uh, and it's tough. It's it's a it's a build engine game. When you die, you start over at the beginning of the level, like a pain in the ass. But these levels are kind of smart the way they unlock things, with the exception of Master Leap's Temple. That one. That one's pretty freaking trolly with its platforming. More detail, interactivity, gags, and hilarious low wang speak than Duke Nukem 3D TM. Hand to face combat mode lets you kick butt, slice and dice in a true ninja style. Drive heavily armored vehicles through walls, over enemies, tanks, bulldozers, forklifts, boats, and more. Hey, my dinghy's hanging out. That's a quote from in the game. Throwing stars, katanas, four-barrel shot guns. There's no four-barrel shotguns. There is a shotgun that fires four things consecutively. That's rad, right? Um, uh, rail guns. Sorry, rail guns, nukes, enemy body parts! Exclamation mark. Dash, the most versatile, gorious, death-dealing armory in gaming history. Lo Wang is Shadow Warrior. So in this box is a very nice CD case with a manual. Ooh. And play on 10 card. Need a hint? This looks like the you wouldn't steal a purse font. <laughs> So yeah, just basic stuff here. Hey, look, it's one of those Gravis pads with the, um, one second. It's one of the Gravis pads with the, uh, uh, the joystick, the fight stick. That's the non-pro version. There we go. Yeah, so there's the backstory. Basically, your master betrays you. You don't really need to know more than that. You're out to kill Zilla. Zilla, who is a corporate who's a something or other. It really doesn't matter. That's kind of the beauty of it. Demons are invading from a different dimension or something, and that's, you just, you kill them all. That's it. That's all you need to know. CD's already in there. I'm not missing it. <laughs> I just got one of those pro ones in a box with the stick. Hell yes! Look at that boxy sweetness. Ooh, quad shot. Yeah, that's awesome, Seacross, because I, I have one of those too, and I, I had to look high and low. Well, I didn't look high and low, I didn't get on eBay, but like, I was all over the Goodwills until I found one with a stick. Alright, so this one's got a nice cardboard thing to keep it, you know, vape-ish, kinda helped back here. But look at this, the one dent on here is the one place that the cardboard didn't cover, like... <laughs> Of course, there's your registration card. GT Interactive Software Registration Card. Yep, yep. No one ever mailed one of those in. But that's this box. Now, if you come with me over here, we're gonna grab this box. And then we're gonna come back over here and I'm gonna hit that button again and slap it down the table. Boom! Unlocking the Secrets of Shadow Warrior. 
This is why we're all here today. Also to play Shadow Warrior. You know, I feel like I do need to point this out. Uh, cause you know how like body features um on the Tomb Raider boxes, they're there, right? Look at look at Lo Wang's muscles. This is probably one of the most detailed um uh embosing? Is that right? Or is it beveling? Embosing is the one that goes out, right? Like, this is one of the most detailed I've ever seen in a game box. Like, this one's wild. Look at all all of the different little ridges and rises. Lil Wang is embossed. He's embossed. Lil Wang is embossed. <clears throat> Alright. Okay. Okay. PC CD-ROM, Windows 95. Game Wizard helps you to unlock the secrets of Shadow Warrior. I actually thought it said that, but it does not. Interactive Strategy Guide, Official Authorized Edition. Here's Lo Wang again, but he's not embossed here. A comprehensive and cool guide, exclamation mark. Game Wizards gives you more Wang for your buck. George Broussard, President 3D Realms. This lady here, I will show you how to get the most out of Wang, Hai Chi, Game Wizard. Full motion video. View actual gameplay. Jump to any trouble spot and get answers quickly, exclamation mark. Awesome kicking Miss Act Mick Acking Ugh. Awesome Hicky Mick Assington. I saw you follow the other night and I had a really good chuckle at your name. That was awesome. Um, I will reach out here in a second once I'm done reading the front of the box. Printable game walkthrough. That's exciting. Exclusive collectible features. Collectible features. Not collectibles. Collectible features. That means files. Hear Lo Wang's wise words that never made the final cut, plus all of those that did. See early artist renderings of Lo Wang. I'll reach out here real quick. Unlock the Wang. We've got to unlock the Wang. <clears throat> well, I mean, I totally butchered the name, Kiki McAssington. I saw it and knew exactly what it said, but just, yeah. Delivery. Terrible. <laughs> Look at that boxing. Okay, quad shot. Mail that baby in. <laughs> Hell yes, the sinews. Definitely need more Wang for my buck. Don't we all, my friend? Don't we all? Lil Wang 2021. I mean, if Lil Wang wanted to run for president, shit would get done. It wouldn't be pretty, and everybody, everybody would be offended everywhere in the world, but I suspect Wang puns are gonna be the theme of this stream. Why don't you old school why don't you redeem one of the channel point redemptions you'll know which one because i don't think you were here when somebody tried it the first time i'll wait slim fat and sean found the new ones who wants us some wang You're welcome. I spent all night working on that. Ooh, onto some way! Oh my god. Okay. Yo, put a time limit on it. <laughs> Ooh, onto some way! <laughs> I could feel another one come. Ooh, no, no, that was the wrong screen. You almost got, you almost got a free one there. <laughs> so dumb. No, I spent all night trying to get that right. Um, and like, wants us some wang. The only thing I have to do is turn it off. But I did, like I said earlier, I figured out how to make a redeemable in Twitch trigger something in OBS on my computer. Um, two for free, but unlimited for $2 a month. We're going to be looking at that for changing the camera angles all over the room and, you know, we'll be able to like, well, hell, we'll be, we'll be able to fix it when I forget to switch cameras if I wanted to. 
If every time, every time there's havoc side boob, right? We'll be able to like chat can redeem like uh, get the camera back where it's supposed to be. That'd be pretty smart. Sorry, I had to do one. Greetings. Hey, Riku the crate. Welcome back. House of Mike. Welcome in. Slim fat. I don't know if I specifically said hello. C cross. And Kiki Miss Mick Ac little, little, little. Kiki Mick Assington. I just love that name. All right. What is the Game Wizards? What is Game Wizards? Game Wizards unlocks secrets in an interactive CD guide that gives you the ultimate way to master Shadow Warrior TM. This is the only CD-ROM that allows you to conquer the game by watching actual segments of full motion video. Game Wizards state-of-the-art map technology <laughs> allows you to enter the game at any level, view trouble spots, and solve problems quickly with the help of Game Wizards host. Game Wizards host, what was it, Lee Chen? No, that's wrong. What was their name? Hai Chi. Wow, okay. My bad. Interactive features. Map technology allows you to enter the level, full motion video, on-screen host leads you through the game, printable, blah blah blah, collectibles. Pretty much everything from the beginning. There's an example of artwork here. There's... This reminds me of a box that I've got on the wall back there that's like Star Wars Behind the Magic or something. Um, that... <clears throat> kind of like walked you through movie scenes and like told you about easter eggs and shit like that who oh no who do you pay two dollars a month for that twitch no um sorry i should have said that let me let me share a link i'll share a link i can do that easily um so okay this is my dashboard but I think it's just betterpoints.com. Better better dash points.com. Yeah, this is it. Okay. I'm just gonna paste it in here. Uh copy. Uh oh. Betterpoints.com. So it's just it's integration through Twitch, but you can use OBS WebSocket to connect it. Um, I just freaking stumbled on it today, like about 30 minutes before I jumped in the shower and I'm like, holy shit, I have to use that. What's today's secret snack? Today's snack, clearly, has to be Asian mix, light pittig, uh, from the Netherlands, which came in, um, Firexy's box. Clearly, we had to get the, the Dutch Asian mix, right? The Dutch Asian mix, right? Right? I've been kind of hanging on to that one just for this. Okay, the moment we've all been waiting for. Because this thing is sealed. I wish I had like a samurai sword to open this. That would be dope as shit. Put that over there without stabbing a monitor. Uh oh. <laughs> I'm freaking pumped for this. I don't know how good or bad this is going to be. And I've never seen or even heard of anything like this for a video game. Like, who knows how many these guys made? I probably could have, like, tried to research that, but I didn't. You know I have to do this, right? Hmm. Actually smells really nice. Not gonna lie. That new old box smell. I've been like dying to find out what was in here for like a month and a half. <laughs> Man, this is... Don't bend, don't break. Gotta remain perfect. Oh. This, oh wow, okay. Very nice. Look at this. That is a sturdy box right there. This is it. This is all that's in here, guys. There is nothing else. Oh! Whoa. Okay, okay, okay. I was wrong. Look at this. This is... This is really cool, actually. Huh. I just, it's, you know, it amazes me how creative people can be with cardboard to hold a thing in place. Like, seriously, like, this is like, you go to engineering school for shit like this, right? 
that just like folds in like it's it's a normal thing you break the lines and you fold it in like and just assemble hundreds of these right you fucking need an engineering degree for shit like that all right here it is one disc shadow warrior If cardboard had transformer sounds, I know, right? Zink, zink. Yep. I've seen games from big box publishers with way worse boxes than I know, right? I mean, look at look at any Tomb Raider box. Like they're all of their um, like they just open. Like, well, no, that's not true because doing the trapezoidal thing actually takes some whatever. Product registration card. Why would I ever, never? GT Interactive Value Products. Wait a second. This is not for this. GT was the publisher. No? Okay. Wow. Okay, so GT actually put this out as well. Um, they're the ones that put out the game. That's interesting. Alright, so this is a... Oh, okay. Like a fold-out walkthrough that tells you how to hit buttons. Oh, 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 oh! Look for these Game Wizard titles for... There's one for Tomb Raider. Okay, so it's Duke Nukem 3D, Redneck Rampage, Tomb Raider, Duke Nukem 3D, Atomic, NASCAR Racing 2, Lord of the Realm, and many more, it says. Um, $29.95, $4.95 shipping. You remember when things were like 95 cents and not 99? That's, that's the way I like it. Register that. <laughs> oh my God, please. I did, Slim Fat. Um, it's like, Two weeks, three weeks ago in December? Yeah, I just did that. Um, there's a VOD. I ain't playing it again. <laughs> Spoiler alert. <laughs> hey, yuck. I missed it. It's true, you did. I'm sorry, man. But there's a VOD. I think there's even some clips from it, too. A couple clips, because that game was wacky. Alright, so these guys are definitely going to go... Back in here. We are never going to use them, I assume. Alright, I'll put this box back together. I think it's pretty cool that they actually put it in this way. Ooh, that was nice, huh? That was nice, huh? Alright. That was exciting. Now we're going to find out what's on the disc. First, we're going to put this up here on our nice little installation. There we go. See, isn't that nice? All that red. I want the big box expansion as well. All right. Let's get you up here. All right, so we're gonna pull out the Shadow Warrior CD. Also, I hope everybody's having a wonderful day if I haven't said that to everyone that came in. I have SimCity 2K in a floppy. That's nice. I've never gotten into a sim game, but I understand their value, for sure. Well, that's not true. I did play Theme Hospital and a couple things like that, but not like an actual sim game. I've been very tempted by The Sims every once in a while, but never committed. So let's hope that this works in Windows 98 here. Theme Hospital was great. Yeah, I had some real frustration with that one. Um, I quite enjoyed it, while hating it. <laughs> Hence, frustration. Come on. What do you got? Let's do it. We're still running the theme from the Tomb Raider uh, Unfinished Business. Come on. Alright, I guess I gotta come in here and do it myself. Um, What's it set up? Game Wizard Guide Shadow Warrior. Wow, that's a that's a thing, isn't it? One disc to rule them all. Let's see, it's literally just a jewel case. Oh, the floppy disc was okay. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, I have a couple. I have a couple boxes just like that. Um, I mean, Shadow Warrior was pretty much. <laughs> Install QuickTime 2.1. Wow, this is like 1K. It probably reads right off of the disk. All right, let's do it. Let's do it all. Let's see if we can break Windows 98. 
Weep. Love the sound of. To avoid conflicts with existing versions of QuickTime, uh, install can find them and allow you options of deleting them. Okay. Right? Okay. You gonna dig through my mid 90s porn? What do we got here? Data collection, right here. <clears throat> So who's got big plans for, um, oh shit, what am I doing? Guys, while this, whoa, that was a really cool loading bar. Holy shit. I got, I got one more thing. I got one more thing. Come back over here. It's me, Matteo. Um, we got a giveaway today for these, for December t-shirts, December 2021. I'm going to give away two. I know I said one, but I'm giving away two. I'm also going to change this around because we don't need that anymore. One sec. Whoop. We're going to turn it on so I can be nice and bright. So, I got two of these I'm going to give away. They are sized to the winner. Yeah, that's Kate Archer back there. That's actually a Night Dive Studio um, poster. Um, well, here. I can show you. <laughs> Whoop, there we go. Yeah, it's, um, it's actually from Night Dive Studio when they almost had the rights to publish it and they couldn't quite find them. But, yeah. I've also got, I love this one, my Laura Croft. I only play for sport one. That is, these two are like my favorite posters in the world. There's also in this room, back in the back wall, like kind of like a, a pinup style of Jade from Beyond Good and Evil with a camera. Which I'm not going to get up and look at, but it's over there. But onto the, onto the giveaway. I cannot wait to give these away. This will be a total of four by the end of today that I've given away. Um, so to enter this, you're gonna type, well, whatever the bot tells you to type. I think it's all capitals, exclamation mark, December. Um, if you enter this, like, forewarning, you need to be comfortable with giving me an address because I'm going to order the size that you want from the store, put your address in and send it to you rather than like, well, any other way of doing that, that'll take longer. So, that's the deal. Um, I'm going to pick two people, or I'm going to have the bot pick two people at the end of the stream. So you have all stream to enter. Rather than just being like an hour from now. So probably three-ish hours, I think. We're already at 2.30. Good. Good. Um, well, here's the giveaway. So go ahead. That null point is stylish as fuck. I know. I've got so many posters that I wish I could put up, but there's no wall space left. Like, I've covered it all in. Um, awesome, awesome, awesome. The only thing about this giveaway is the two people that have won already don't enter, obviously. I don't think either of them are here, but that's my only thing is like, you know, you don't need to win twice. Um, and if you don't win and you still want a December t-shirt, um, the bot will randomly drop a store link. They're only $13, I think, plus some shipping. I think it all comes to like 25 bucks in the end, so it's like normal online t-shirt price. Um, but they are very comfortable. So comfortable. You can pick any color you want. Um, the one that I prefer the most is definitely the Heather Gray. I think it looks the best with the design, but people have had good luck with red, blue, my wife got a purple one, which looks pretty good. Like, it looks okay. This particular color of blue kind of clashes in my mind, but... Already won one, so no need to enter. Yeah, $25 is pretty normal for an online shirt. I mean, the store page, they go on sale for, like, $13. I don't know if they're currently on sale. It's one of those websites where everything's always on sale with a countdown. You know what I mean? But... I'm taking them off of the store after this weekend, so uh, Monday morning they won't be there. Uh, and I'm going to be working on like a like actual Havoc brand something or other. There's also some ideas floating around for the Save and Raid event with the the, Yo the logo, the logo that Yoshi made. Um, and if you don't know what Save and Raid event is, that is where it's a relay race of streamers playing Doom and passing the save file on. First streamer plays, their time's up, they save the file, upload it, send the, the, the crowd through a raid to the next streamer. 
they download that file, continue the game, and so on and so forth until we get through all of Doom 1 and, and its expansions. That's going to be in February. I'm really excited about that. Um, all of the proceeds, or all of the proceeds, all of the donations that are going to be for that and the t-shirt um, profit are going to go to SAVE, which is a suicide prevention, awareness, and health network that's international. Because um, that shit's really important to me. Like, suicide just, it's not good, guys. You know, you know how it is. But, you know, when you're down and you need help, like, there needs to be a place to, you know, somebody to talk to. And I think save, save, save and raid, um, not a sales pitch, is, um, it's just perfect. It's just perfect and I love it. Um... Also, we did a big playthrough of Diablo called Blood Lily, A Journey Below Tristram, the original Diablo. And I have narrations that were written um, by Joshum Games and recorded narration of those by my wife, which we used as like prologue to each new stream of like what had happened before, like a previously on. But I'm taking all those narrations and combining them with gameplay footage, turning it into Blood Lily the movie. There's probably going to be a Blood Lily t shirt. And when we air that, when we air uh, that uh, movie, the save file disc is going to be loaded with all the written narrations and well, anything else I can fit on here, pretty much. And that's going to be given away in a drawing. I've just decided. Like, I've been rolling the idea around, but that's what's happening with it. So when we stream the actual movie, there'll be a giveaway for that. That's coming when it's ready. So, who the fuck knows? I've got a lot of video editing to do, you know? Alright, let me let me catch up with chat as we hop over here and start working on seeing what this unlocks in our game. Hopefully I've got like all the talking talking done for a while and I don't have to revisit any of those things. <laughs> okay. Do you want an over... What? Uh, what? An overload poster. Really? Yeah, talk to me in PMs. I, um... I mean, I've got some blank space over there. An overload poster would be fucking sweet. Wow. Yeah, talk to me in PMs later. Um, already ordered so many to enter. Spend about that on three shirts a piece for Christmas. Spent about that on three shirts a piece. Right. Well, you know, the, the thing about, here's the thing about T Public, which is where I'm uploading my designs to sell. Um, it's just shipping once. You order a whole bunch of $13 shirts and pay $25 shipping, like $13 shirts, that ain't a joke. Like, that's cheap. I don't even think you can get that at, like, Target or maybe Walmart, but you get really terrible quality Walmart. These are nice, like, actually nice shirts. They aren't that, like, super, like, unflexible, like, heavy cotton or... Uh, I haven't had one shrink. I air dry them, but I haven't had one shrink on me, even though they are cotton. But they're, you know, they're just nice and flexible, and they move with your shoulders, which I have problems with shirts. My shoulders are kind of weird. I don't know. Super weird. Havoc is weird. Confirmed. Been busy at work, but the secrets thing, Shadow Warrior, sounds like the pitch for PlayStation's new video hint system. Which also is too good to be true, right? I know, I know, I know. I love cotton shirts. I can't stand polyester. Yep, these are cotton. I'd prove it, but I just pulled the tag out of this one. Tag came out easy, too. If you don't like tags, these tags come out nice and easy without fucking up the back of the shirt. All right. Finish and start guide with Game Wizards for Shadow Warrior. This is me crossing my fingers, not flipping you off. Promise. Oh my god, the tension right now. <laughs> it's all right if you guys got direction from that. I'm going to show you all of the tips, strategies, and secrets you'll need to get the most out of Mr. Wang. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm Hai Chi. This is the most comprehensive, interactive strategy guide there is. 
phone motion video together with Game Wizard's map technology. You'll actually see Lo Wang in action, as well as pinpoint tough spots and bosses in their exact location. So don't be a tiny grasshopper. Give him some wag. Oh my god! Okay, I'm in love. I'm in love. This is... Oh boy! Consider this area your own private dojo. From here you can get to all the areas in the guide. Each one holds the stuff you'll need to become the ultimate warrior. Good luck! We'll get to fun stuff, Brunic. Just hold your horses. We're gonna go counterclockwise around this mother... Okay, this is better than I was expecting. Look at look at this. He's holding a heart. What wonderful art is this? So good. Ooh, wants us some wang. I don't remember how to get back. Okay. <laughs> Strategies. Let's do it. All right, Hai Chi. In here. Strategies and tips for taking care of all the evil creatures and bosses. Plus, I'll show you how to navigate through the tough spots. <clears throat> Remember, Grasshopper, a ninja knows no fear. Dude, Tai Chi is my fucking hero. She is so into this. Like, so into this. Lady Game Guy, was that you that redeemed that? Welcome in. I'm doing my best to keep up with chat. There's so many, so much bot spam. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bosses. Do we just jump into bosses or creatures? I see it's in alphabetical order. All right, come on. Serpent God, Zilla, Sumo Boss. These are good bosses in this. I mean, it's just like shoot until it's dead, but. The most effective way to drop the Serpent God is use physics. He is fast and tough, and has a circle of skulls that protect him from close attacks. But he also large and clumsy, so try to get behind a pillar and bounce grenades at him. Also, welcome in, House of Mike. I don't think I said hi, sorry. A clear shot. Whatever you do, don't stay in one place for very long. <laughs> so that's a neat, Keep your neat tactic. He is as fat as he is stinky. The real gun is very effective only if you are an efficient shooter. If not, use combination of missiles and grenades. It really helps to have the ram card in your missile launcher when you deal with the fat zone. <laughs> oh my god. They just don't think care. Godzilla is impossible to destroy. Remember, <clears throat> Grasshopper, nothing is impossible for a ninja who knows no fear. You can only withstand two hits from him with full armor, so stay mobile. Ironically, the most effective way to kill Mr. Zilla is with combination of Uzis and Riot Gun. Get in close and fire short bursts, then run around him shooting. The most difficult thing to do is stay on the platform. Uh, then, then run around him shooting. Oh my god. This, the bit rate? Yeah, yeah, these are quick time videos. I mean, we're, this is, what's, oh, rewind. Okay, okay. Uh, back. Back, back. Main? Okay, okay. Creatures. Hello? Hello? Evil ninja. The best way to take care of green and red ninjas is with the Uzi. Watch out for red ones. They fire missiles at you. Those evil ninjas. The green ninjas are tough because they invisible. Watch out. They will cause flash bombs and napalm at you. Try and get in close and let them have it with Uzi or Riot Gun. Lady Game Guy, have you not been paying attention? We are, we opened up, 
Well, first we opened up my box copy of Shadow Warrior, right? And then we opened up an interactive strategy guide called Unlock the Secrets of Lo Wang Shadow Warrior. And we're be it's just, this is amazing. This is probably the best money I've ever spent. <clears throat> I wonder how they recorded this. Or did they just record the screen, process it, and place a filter and hope it came out? I know, right? Like, I mean, they made video game trailers. But you could do a... Di I don't know, because 1997? Like, what screen capturing, recording stuff was out there? Open a can of whoop <laughs> Oh, coolies. These guys. These guys suck. Coolie is to blow him up. If you shoot him and leave his body... A ghost may materialize and give you a really hard time. Yeah, they suck. They suck! These apparitions occasionally rise from dead coolies' body. They can make themselves invisible and move very quickly. You'll need to be very accurate with Uzi to drop one of these. Oh, just give me a hard time on the paying attention part, lady. <laughs> and I realized that sounded kind of harsh, maybe. Baby rippers are extremely fast. So yeah. don't use single-fire weapons on them. Cut them down with riot gun bursts or nice spray of lead from your Uzis. The secret is not to get too close to Ripper. Otherwise, they'll pull your heart out. The most effective way to drop Ripper is with your riot gun on auto. Giant Ripper is a nasty thing to run into. We find railgun works best if you are an accurate shooter. Otherwise, use your missile launcher from a distance. These guys are big, big, though. fast, and strong. Bees. The secret is not to unload your guns on bees unless you are accurate. Let them get in close and slice them with your sword. Oh, right. Really easy target, but don't take them for granted. The last thing you need to do is waste a lot of time fighting one and run out of air in process. You in process. My god. My god. The stereotypes are just, they're so, they're there. They're there. <clears throat> as sexy as she is dangerous, she throws sticky mines at you as well as fire lightning bolts from her crossbow. Female warriors will attack from a distance, so try to deal with her at close range with a railgun or riot gun. Dude, this girl has thrown her entire soul into it. Hi Chi here. And who knows if that's her real name, but like I I love it. These guys are very tough. Best way to drop a guardian is with a guardian head. Give them a little taste of their own medicine. Hey Jetter, how you doing today? We're unlocking the uh <laughs> the secrets of Shadow Warrior. Okay, okay, so there's some tough spots. Let's see. Cheat codes are in here. Win Pachinko. Tips on weapons. I'm gonna pretend I know everything. Hey guys, you know, if you're not following Jetter Gaming though, I haven't gotten to shout him out in a while. If I have a mod around, that would be awesome. If not, I'll do it here in a minute. Jetter Gaming, he's doing a lot of fun. You're streaming tonight, aren't you, bud? <clears throat> oh, you know. Is it me or is the sound a little light? I can I can amp it up a little bit, sorry. You guys are just going to have to remind me to turn it back down uh, when... Uh, uh -oh. when we get into the game because it will oh wait me you guys are talking about me i'm sorry let me let me fix that boop, 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 boop. my bad forgot to bring the microphone with me there we go perfect <clears throat> shareware levels tough spots this sparkling boy i break you enough So that was a voice line from Tomb Raider 2. Womp womp. All right, all right. So that tried to like open a PDF or something. I don't know.
But yeah, Jedder, are you streaming tonight? My plan was to raid you tonight if you were. I thought I saw that you were. Awesome. Because I haven't gotten you yet this week, man. <laughs> Get ready for the ultimate way to match a shadow warrior. During the Chaco Spicy Challenge tonight. Tonight, I'm opening a brand new beer. That, um, I had, I had a little bit of it yesterday, but I'm opening one towards the end of the stream tonight. That we brewed. From here you can um, all the areas in the guide. It'd be pretty cool. Select a world, and you'll see a map of each level. It'll show you where all the secrets, tough spots, and bosses are located. Click a spot on the map to see the best strategies to use. Don't forget, Grasshopper, pain is for the weak. Seriously, though, I straight up adore her. This is freaking awesome. Alright, alright, what do you need? What do you need? It's supposed to dump you into a level that you can look at, but I don't know... Hmm. Yeah, it's so unnecessary. It really is. Honestly, like, ah, I love it though. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Consider this area <clears throat> your own private walkthroughs. So the map thing doesn't seem to be working. I'm not gonna spend a ton of time with it. This is probably gonna Oh no! Here we go. Okay, so it's there is a walkthrough here. I mean, the dumb thing here is that you can't use it while you're playing the game, you know? This, this level right here, Dark Woods of the Serpent, is my favorite level probably in any video game ever. There's something about this level that struck a chord with me that I just, it, nothing's ever topped it. So I'm super excited. I hope that we can get to that today. Ah, the fun stuff. Check out some of Lo Wang's classic lines, as well as concept drawings of creatures and Mr. Wang. There is a print button so that you can print out. Well, yes, yes. Okay, I see what you're saying. Insert yourself in like GT GTA and Red Dead Redemption. Shit like that is it's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> so, no! What is your problem here? Is it uh, okay? It's caused an invalid page fall. Well, this is this is disappointing. I really okay. So that was the artwork we can't look at. Hopefully, we can get to the soundboard. That's why we're all here, right? Um. Yeah. I mean, can you imagine? So, you just bought Cyberpunk 2077 and it won't run. Well, stick around. <laughs> Get a hex editor. Get okay, okay, okay. Seriously, though, this is fun as hell. Consider this area your so own private dojo. From here, you can get to all the areas in the guide. Each one holds the stuff you'll need to become the ultimate warrior. So, so here's the thing. I created... Ah, the fun stuff. Check out some of the... Please? Oh, sweet. So, when, when I was in a band, back... When we put out our first album in... Oh... 2010? Yeah, that sounds right. Um, I created a USB live album with an auto run program like this. You stuck it into a computer and it came up with like, you know, like a menu, kind of like this intro menu here. It didn't have videos exactly, but I had like a page with a video player that had some, you know, some of our live shows like really shittily recorded, but still they were there. Um, and you could like listen to each song with like a player at the bottom of the page and it would show like the lyric page, which well, yeah, I, wow, I took all, did all the artwork for that too. This was pretty much 100% me, except for the part where there was other musicians. 
But no, I sat around like all summer 2008 designing this shit and absolutely like loved how it turned out. And we took, we, I will dig up pictures at some point and put them on the discord. Um, and I can also share, I can share the digital album. It'll still run. At least it still ran on windows seven. Um, but I designed it on XP or Vista. I don't remember. But it was a cool thing. I mean, we were we were kind of a terrible band, but I'm proud of what we did. So not making any promises there. <laughs> but I just I absolutely love this stuff. Ancient Chinese secret. There's facial animations. Those weren't the days. I hope you were paying attention. Bonsai! You do that, you go blind. This is not a shawade. Oh my god, a shawade. Whoops, low wing drop soap. You bend over, get it. <laughs> I stick a firecracker your ass. <laughs> hey, baby, pull my finger. <laughs> I am the shadow warrior. Everybody dead. I like that. Everybody dead. I like that. How's that for Kung Fu fighting you chicken shit? A ninja knows no fear. It is natural to die. Somebody said that the other night. Who said that? Was that you, old school? It is natural to die? <laughs> you no mess with Lo Wang. We should have coded this not safe for work, laugh my ass off. No pain, no gain. <laughs> There can be only one. Eat this pencil dick. Eat this pencil dick. You move like a pregnant yak. Chocolate just came in. I am not prepared. Nice. Those real tits? It's all in the reflexes. Ogre scary. Diddly little snake shit face. That was a line from the serpent boss. <laughs> when he kills him. <laughs> when he stumbles over. Oh no. Snatch people from hen. Low wang soap you good. <laughs> I am sitting here getting stiff. <sighs> oh you little tiny dick. Oh, must be American made. That's one of my favorite lines in this game. Pain is for the weak. Oh, better zip fly. <laughs> so that's unlocking the secrets of Shadow Warrior. Oh my God, I love this. This is this is so great. All right, let's play the game. You guys ready to play the game? Man, just, just. Wow. Who wants a swang? So in here, quick time 32, we installed all of that. Resources. <clears throat> what if I told you guys that those sounds are built into the program and are not on the CD. That shocks me. Um, unless they installed on the drive. Holy shit, that look like a Duke Nukem. <laughs> oh, where did you install? Where would you install? Probably in program files. Guess you gotta record it with a phone. <laughs> a lot of CDs did that, yeah. <laughs> Not really seeing any, it installed something it may be just installed no it installed something somewhere 
I just don't see it. I'm probably just blind and missing it. Oh well. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I, I, I know. I know. I just wanted to see where the folder was. You're right. You're right, though. It was only 1K. So that was fun. All right. The best part, guys, is I think I only paid like $15 for that still sealed. So <laughs> that's X3. Oh, Planet X3, huh? That is um a game by uh, Bill Murray, the 8-bit guy. Um, it's a new DOS game from 2018. Uh, you can check my VODs. I did a I did a uh, playthrough earlier this month. Planet X3. All right, it's time for the Shadow Warrior. If you guys if you guys check the VOD from yesterday, I went through all of the known prototypes for this game, um, which was which was neat. Uh, it's the same reason why Quake 1 and 2 need their discs for the music. Yes, this one... Want to some way. Uh, this one also uses the Red Book audio. Which hilariously um, is interchangeable. So, like, if I put my LucasArts Outlaw CD in here, it'll play the same number tracks, but it'll be like Western music over top of Shadow Warrior, and that's kind of hilarious. You can also do that with, like, all the Star Wars Jedi Knight games and stuff like that. I see it. I see it. What's happening here? Did not switch the screens. That's weird. Has it been taking a long time? I guess I haven't noticed. I will give you a manual one. I know. I don't know why it didn't change. I'll give you a manual one. Ooh, want us some way. I'm not going to be doing that all day. It was fast before. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe the bot got stuck. <clears throat> okay. Shadow Warrior. Shadow Warrior. I believe I have it. Well worth it. <laughs> Okay. You know, on this disc, there's actually some cool goodies. Um, we will get to the game. So, goodies. Like, literally in goodies here. There is the build editor. Um, there's also guides to help you use the editor so you can make your own levels documentations on all of that including you know whatever 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 midi files which um which i swiped over to the other computer and used for the stream files that one is very doom this is like my favorite shadow warrior tune just hands down this is the one from the, the woods. You noticed Hellfire. How how far did that go? So Hellfire, we did the special playthrough I was talking about earlier, if you were here. Blood Lily, The Journey Below Tristram, or A Journey Below Tristram. Uh, we did it through that, and we completed everything that Hellfire and Diablo had to offer. Uh, there are VODs. Um, I will continue exporting them to YouTube. Somebody asked about a YouTube. I have a YouTube. I back things up on it. That's about it. It's like youtube.com backslash RDM Havoc. Like, easy to get to. Which class? Rogue. Um, Rogue. Yep. Uh, it was, it was an amazing, uh, experience. Pew! 